Today's video is a new Auto Fanatic professional wheel cleaning foam demonstration. Now, if you look here, this is the original wheel cleaning foam we've been selling for a couple of years, and this is the new version. The reason we switched this up is because the raw material shortages have prevented us from doing more production of this right now. There's like 15 components that go into this. So our chemist had to come up with a plan B, and this is the plan B you're gonna see. This color is red, this one's like a yellowish brown, and we also have a new label. So if anybody buys any of the new bottles off Amazon, you're gonna be getting this current version. So we're gonna do a demonstration today on the Alfa Romeo Stelvio. So if you look carefully, the wheels are absolutely disgusting. Uh, this car has EBC red uh, high performance brake pads in them. And you can see they haven't been cleaned in over a week specifically just to do this demonstration. So we're gonna do a demo for you today using the foam cannon as the application method and also the pump up solo um, foamers that we sell. And we're gonna show you. So it's the same principle, you're gonna mix Take a couple of ounces of the concentrate, you're gonna put it in your foam cannon or your pump up foamer and you're gonna go through it. You could also pre-dilute and mix this in a gallon container to get four plus gallons of concentrated wheel cleaner depending on your needs. So we're gonna get started right now. We're not gonna do a pre-rinse. I don't like pre-rinsing the wheels when we're using the foam cannon because you're blasting it at such a high PSI. So just to recollect, this is the original and this is the current end of 2022. Because of the supply shortages, this is what we're gonna be selling right now until things change, I will make a further announcement. Now, FYI, we may change this back to the uh, clear yellow. We don't know yet. We're just experimenting right now with color specifically to differentiate between the original version and the updated version. This is, the, I call this the plan B version. Uh, we have the new labels and also a little bit of a different color. So we're gonna get started with the demonstration right now. We're gonna do one with the foam cannon and one with the pump up foamer. We're gonna rinse it off and we're gonna see how well we do. All right, guys, first part of the demonstration, we're gonna use the Griot's Garage Brilliant Finish Foam Cannon as the application tool to do the Autofinac Professional Wheel Cleaning Foam. So what I usually do is I just fill it up to about here, and then I just open up the concentrate bottle and I put a couple of ounces, anywhere between two to four ounces. Also, always make sure you agitate and shake it up. You have to do that. I can't even tell you how many times over the years that people just don't do that, and they tell me it doesn't foam up enough. So we're just gonna connect it right now, right there. Okay, cool, hold this. So I just wanna show you guys real quick. You can see no pre-rinse and it's got the same mechanism of the original formula. Okay, look at it, look at all the brake dust that's coming off. If you guys watch the channel, you know my videos. For the last couple of years, I kinda of show you exactly what it's gonna do without agitation. Lug brush, just to get in there. Okay, I actually make these. And we're got the OXO brush, just to get a little bit agitation. We're not gonna touch the spokes. And this brush, if you guys watch my wheel cleaning brush on the, my favorite brushes, this thing is awesome. So you can see it right there, look at the brake dust. That just came off with pretty much no agitation, just a blast of the Brilliant Finish Foam Cannon. You can see it right there. You can actually hear it working. Okay, so just like the original formula, you're gonna wait. Depending on how soiled your wheels are, these are pretty soiled. If you want, you could zap it again uh, if you feel like you're just not getting enough off. But if you look here, I mean, that's a lot of brake dust that came off without any agitation uh, and no pre-rinsing. So I think we're good, let's rinse it off. Another thing I can't even stress more too uh, with wheel cleaning and auto detailing is just get yourself and invest in a proper pressure washer. It's got proper GPMs, anything 1.8 to 2.5 GPMs and anything from an honest 2000 to 3500 PSI. Just use common sense, use the right nozzles. You're not gonna blow the paint off your car. So here we go. Okay, we'll get a closer view. All right guys, so we just rinsed it off. Just gonna uh, go over to the spokes 
rub it with my hands. You can see it's pretty darn clean without agitation, without using brushes on the spokes itself. I just use the lug pocket because it's really, really deep and it's really hard to get in there. Uh, and also just a little uh, quick one with the OXO brush inside the wheelbarrow. You can see the uh, brake caliper is also cleaned. It looks absolutely outstanding. So we're going to move over to the other front wheel because it's the heavily soiled wheel on this car right now for demonstration. Or we're going to use the Solo Pump Up Foamer. We're going to charge it with the air compressor and uh, we're going to show you that demonstration as well. All right, guys, second half of the demonstration, we got the Solo Foamer with the built-in Schrader valve that I sell on the website. Uh, also, I just filled it up probably about halfway and I added three ounces of the new Auto Fanatic Professional Wheel Cleaning Foam Mega Concentrate. Shake it up. I already charged it and these wheels are totally filthy, so let's go. So we get nice, even foam, not too dry, not too wet. Actually, the consistency is phenomenal. I'm gonna try to get into the barrel. And these foamers are great. We sell a lot of them, and now you can go on our website and order them with the built-in valve. And the great thing about this product is that we could, you know, we're giving you a mega concentrate, so you could kind of mix and dilute it. I mean, check this out, guys. I mean, look at the brake dust coming off. And that's with no pre-rinse, no foam cannon. That's just with the product being atomized in a very small, convenient pump-up foamer. So, go into the lug pocket. These things get filthy on this car. I gotta tell you, since I put track pads on this car, <laughs> the wheels are really, really dirty. So this is a good, a good demonstration. I'm gonna kind of go into the barrel. Okay. And if you want, you could also take the same brush and you could kind of go do this. You know, if you want to hit the spokes really quickly, but the wheel cleaner has great yield and you can see what it's doing. I mean, it's just absolutely incredible. It's non-corrosive. I'm not wearing gloves. There's no fumes. Uh, we didn't add a fragrance to it, and I don't think I'll ever going to do that. I just don't think it's needed for wheel cleaning purposes. So we're going to just pull the camera back. And I'm using the um, MTM Aqualine 40 degree nozzle. And you can see here, wheels are perfectly clean. It came out really nice. Didn't really take much effort. A couple of spots you're probably gonna miss. You're gonna probably hit it uh, when you're drying off the wheels. But if you guys go on Amazon and you see the new bottle or you receive the new bottle, this is the new version of the Auto Fanatic wheel cleaning foam. We no longer have this one in stock. So if you also order it from our website, this is what you're gonna be receiving. Uh, we also are not sure if we're going to keep the red color. I actually like it for identification purposes. Uh, it's a little bit different, change it up a little bit, but we may go back to the clear yellow. But pay attention, this is the new cleaner, uh, wheel cleaner label. You can see how distinctly different they are between the original and what we have now. So if you guys are interested, head over to the website today. You could go on Amazon. If you go on Amazon, they may not ship it for one to two months. I don't know what's going on with them. Uh, we sent a bunch of inventory, but they're just taking forever to get it into their system. Thanks for watching this video. If anybody has questions or comments or feedback, if you get the new bottle, please send the feedback directly through the Auto Fanatic website. We take that feedback and we go back to the drawing board. We fine tune and tweak things along the way when we introduce a new product. I appreciate the support. Thanks for watching this video and stay tuned for more content. And we have some new exciting products that we're gonna be releasing very soon, as soon as the chemical shortages and supplies start getting a little bit better. Uh, we have a bunch of new products that we're gonna release to the Auto Fanatic Car Care line. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more content.